of the Sugar Factory. Yay! Yay! We have so many things, including the Sugar Factory famous rainbow burgers. All right, and we also have the shakes. We have a chocolate shake with magic ice cream. We have vanilla shakes. We got donuts. We got candy. We got cookies. We got a bunch of stuff, ladies. Woohoo! Hope you can those rainbow burgers. <laughs> they're, they're very easy to make, so I hope you give it a try. Well, did you hear me butcher that? What I was trying to say, let's get started making our copycat version of Sugar Factory's Rainbow Burgers. Just a few tools you'll need, and if there's more, I'll let you know along the way. First thing, let's activate our yeast. Two cups of water, a half cup of milk, six tablespoons of sugar, and three teaspoons of salt. And your three tablespoons of instant dry yeast. Mix that up. Cover it up with some saran wrap. And set that aside for about five minutes or so. And this is the bread flour I use, King Author. For your bread, you're going to need six cups of bread flour. You're going to add your activated yeast. Look at that. Add your two eggs. Then add your one cup of vegetable oil. I recommend vegetable oil. Stir that until the dough forms into a ball. And it should look like that. Go ahead and knead your dough for about three to five minutes. I like to give it a light touch. That sit for about 30 minutes until your dough looks like that. Okay, we're going to knead that dough and we're going to start cutting. Start cutting your dough into the sections to prepare it to shape it into the hamburger buns. Always that uneven number. We'll work it out. I'm gonna grease up my bowls because I don't want the dough to stick to the bowls. There you have it. All seven. Greasing up my hands a little bit and I'm reshaping the dough just a bit just to help add in some of the layers and smooth the dough for cutting. What you see me doing now is creating wells in the dough to prepare it for the coloring. You're gonna need those gloves. You wanna put a substantial amount of coloring in the dough. and you want to work the dough through to the shade that you desire. Here you see me using my bench knife to move the color through the dough. I'll give you a short example of one more. You need to try it. <laughs> Getting that color all the way through. Ta da! I chose these colors to represent the colors of the Sugar Factory's Rainbow Burgers. You choose whatever colors you like. Go ahead and wrap your dough. 
and let it sit for about another 15 minutes in a warm place. I put mine on top of my stove. Okay, getting ready to cut out these burgers and shake them. As you can see, I cut them in four squares. And I'm just kind of roping them around because I want them to be a little bit layered. And as you can see, I pinched the ends. And we have a perfect shaped hamburger bun. Do that for all the colors. Now mind you, I made burgers for a lot of people. You're welcome to cut the recipe in half. Look how vibrant those colors are. Beautiful. <gasps> ah, ready to go in the oven, aren't they? Beautiful. Remember those roasted sesame seeds I had from the sushi video? Make sure you watch that, but I used them to top my rainbow burgers. Ah, uh, right at the temperature I need. You want your burgers to be at about 150. Look at that, soft. And if you could only smell how delicious these smell. Go ahead and take your snapshot. It's time to make the hamburgers. This is what you'll need. You know how we do it. Time to cut up these peppers and onions. Watch me go. Okay, put your green peppers in your hamburger mixture and let's get started on our onions. Got to show myself putting the onions in the hamburger mixture, but you're a smart cookie. All right, here we have our seasonings. We have our garlic powder, onion powder, pepper, and we have a pack of beef flavored onion soup. You are welcome to use the brand you like. I use Lipton. Gonna mix that up. Get all those seasonings through your ground beef. And start making your patties. Now if you're anal, you can weigh them out. But me, I'm just going to eyeball it. Guys, I'm going to start laying my hamburger patties out in this beautiful seasoned pan. Man, she's seen a lot of meals. And then you'll see that I added some fresh rosemary. But wait, there's more. Ha ha, everything's better with butter. Go ahead and put a dab of butter so they can melt down into that patty seared in with that delicious rosemary. The smell of rosemary is intoxicating. All right, let's prepare it for the oven. Look at that, in she goes. Look at that deliciousness and the smell! Wow! Okay, guess what? Time to assemble our burger. Look at the beautiful texture on our hamburger bun. I'm gonna go ahead and add on a spicy mayo that I made. Basically, I added smoked serrano sauce to mayo and just a little bit of ketchup. burger. I use white American cheese. I'm going to make that simple for the kiddos. Okay, we've assembled all of our burgers. Now, let's get back to the Rainbow Girls. Alright, where should we start? I say no dessert for your meal. So you're going to have to eat some of these burgers. You guys ready? Yes! Yeah. Alright! Alright, so we're going to start with our rainbow burgers. Now, I want to ask you guys, Eddie, what do 
is your favorite color? It's rainbow burger. What's the place? Red. Red. Ariel, what's your favorite color? Purple. Woohoo! All right, then they're gonna get purple and red. I think I'll go for the yellow. All right, doesn't that look yummy? Yeah. All right, you want some french fries? Yeah. Some french fries, but they are hot, so be careful. Okay. Ariel, I know. You look for fun. Now, guys, these are the rainbow girls. But right here, we have Ariel. Say hi, Ariel. Hi. And we have Addie right here, her best friend. Hi, guys. <laughs> and I'm going to get me some fries. And, guys, we're going to try this out and see how these rainbow burgers taste. Aren't they cool? They are cool. And guys, as I said before, I have the instructions on how you can make these rainbow burgers, and they're really not that difficult. When I thought about making bread, I was a little bit afraid because I thought bread making was difficult. But it was easy as high. Um, I would say coloring them was probably harder than making them. But that's how it is. But listen, the food dye. It's exactly that. It's dye. It's the same dye that you eat in all the birthday cakes and everything. So the dye we have here is safe, safe to eat. It's the same dye that you, you see placed in icing that's your favorite local bakery. So guys, let's go ahead and let's give our burgers a try. Now guys, let me tell you what I put on the burger. Now I know young kids sometimes don't like a lot of fixings on the burger. So what I put on ours, I have the burger, I have some white American cheese, and I have a mayo, uh, a mayo, kind of a spicy mayo on here, and I'll put the name of that mayo, a habanero, habanero a mayo. It's a little bit spicy, but it's more mayo than spice. And I've seen these chicas eat a lot of hot fries, so I know they can handle it. Guys, let's give it a chance. Try it. Yes, I'm good. <laughs> I'm Oh my gosh, you do. They said they can eat hot Cheetos and hot toes and stuff like that with no hot. water. Hey, hot. Excuse me. Hot. Let's try our burger, guys. Here you go. Rainbow burgers, but I don't want to extend the video too long. 
and I did not show how I made the milkshake cup. So if you want me to do a video on how I made the milkshake cup, just let me know and maybe that's something I'll think about. <laughs> um, let me tell you, everything here, it is a labor of love. So while we're focusing on the rainbow burgers and the fries, also, I think we need to mention these beautiful chocolate chip cookies that are filled with cookie dough. And you can find that at your local grocery. It's a grocery kit. And I'll, I'll, I'll show you in the comments where I got that from. We have candy, we have cakes. Man, we have a lot to go. So ladies, let's go ahead and give ourselves another little bite. Mmm. Get those rocks. Oh, nice and hot, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. You gotta scoot over because we want to be able to see you. There you go, scoop, hey. Mmm. All right. Be careful. Oh, my gosh. Be careful, huh? You like the burger? She's not the biggest burger fan because her favorite restaurant is McDonald's for the what? Every time she goes to get chicken nuggets, she never gets a burger. So I'm very happy that she's eating this burger today. Yes, we're gonna go ahead and eat this. All right. Ooh, and she tore up those fries. <laughs> you did too. You can do it. Really good. Look at that. See? 
you want to eat them. Jackie, don't throw them. Can I have one? <laughs> you can go ahead. Ooh. And yeah, you know, I gave you chocolate because why? Mm -hmm. You love chocolate. You love chocolate. Mm hmm. You said you weren't the pencil. Mm hmm. Oh my God. Those chocolate covered pretzels, y'all. <laughs> Never mind my own business. Get in mind. Well, look, this donut. I'm not scared. It looks beautiful. I just don't want to have a heart attack. <laughs> what do you think, Annie? <laughs> what do you think, Ariel? Did you try yours? I'm going to be done. Mmm. Try it before? Mm-hmm. I like it. Oh, mermaid and unicorn mix together. I wish they had mermaid. You're gonna go another little. I'm about to steal. What it ends. It's okay. Have we added? Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah. 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 Oh. Jeez. Louise? Oh, sorry, guys. You want, you want, you want a pretzel? Can I do that to you? Mm. Oh boy, you got beautiful ice cream. What do you guys think? What? Mm. Take it. Take it. What are you going to do with that? She said she got a good idea. Mm. I got an idea too. The whole cake. <laughs> yeah. Mm, you take you want it. to eat it. <laughs> you want to eat it. <laughs> That'll be for later. <laughs> <laughs> I know one thing. I know one thing. This oh, ice cream. This. It's the it's mermaid it's and the good. dragon. I think. And it's Kroger brand. If you have a Kroger in the city, or the local grocery store may have it. Rainbow and it's the dragon mixed together. You see it's two colors, purple and blue. And it is quite delicious. It tastes magical. Yeah. Like it's unicorn. Cool. Hey guys. Guess what I'm eyeballing though? Yeah, you have whipped cream. You got chocolate, whipped cream, ice cream, chocolate covered pretzels and pretzels. You got Ooh, she's getting Whoa, look at that. Mmm. <laughs> guys, I'm gonna go for it. Mm. It's so cute. Oh my god, it must be like a thousand calories in one bite. Uh, you ready? Uh -huh. Do I have to? Yeah. <laughs> mm. Good gosh. Okay. Go dry. Candy and Skittles and Sour Worms. 
You guys want some? Dig in! Dig in the candy! Yeah, you want to stand on your knees there? Yeah, you can stand on your knees. Oh, she's the first on the top. That's cool. Really? Oh. I wish I could tell you the name of it, but I can't. I know those are um, the sour gummy bears and some of those. I think these are lemon heads. They're not lemon heads, but they're like lemon heads. Oh, she's decorating her duck. Mmm. Oh my god, Trey. God, that's not a lemon head. That is banana. Mmm. That banana. They're so good. What banana do you like banana head? Uh oh. Uh -uh. I love my unicorn horn. No, no. Mmm. You made a banana. Yeah. 